Good evening and welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. You clicked on to Long Range Weather Forecast Discussion for May 14th to the 26th. From May 14th to the 18th, troughs forecast here in the west. We also have a trough here in the Aleutians. We have a ridge over um, south the Aleutians, over Alaska, Canada, and above normal heights across the eastern U.S. And what we're looking at is generally a westerly flow across the west central U.S. with a trough here. Models are in good agreement with this, and we're going to go to the 18th, and we see very little change in the overall circulation features. Uh, most of the ensembles are forecasting um, below normal temperatures across the western U.S., and with anomalies of 10 to 20 degrees above norm, uh, below normal, and above normal temperatures forecast across the east central U.S. with anomalies of 10 to 20 degrees above normal. Now we're going to look at the period for May 17th to the 21st. Here we are at the 18th and the models are indicating little change in overall circulation pattern. We still have our ridge here, our ridge here over uh, western Canada, Alaska, and we still have our trough here near the Aleutians. And now we're going to go forward in time. We're going to go to the 21st. And we see very little change in, in the circulation. And we're going to go through um, the models. Now, this is the um, Canadian, and it has a trough more uh, broadly uh, placed broadly across the western U.S. with the westerly flow in the east and we're going to look at temperature anomalies still forecasting uh, above normal temperatures for most of the nation and you can see this anomaly this is the Canadian has um, below normal temperatures in the in the west but I think overall um, this is we're going to have above normal temperatures across much of the nation so this is how it looks on the maps. We're going to have um, below normal temperatures, uh, above normal temperatures here, below normal temperatures here, above normal temperatures for east of the Rockies, uh, east of the Mississippi River. And the anomalies during this forecast period are forecast to be uh, 10 to 20 degrees above normal in the east and below normal temperatures, southern Rockies, southwest plains, upper Mississippi Valley with anomalies of 5 to 20 degrees are forecast. Uh, for precipitation, I am calling for above normal precipitation across a large area of the nation except for the southeast and lower mid-Atlantic. Now we're going to look at the period for May 22nd to the 26th. Here we are at the 26th, and we're kind of see like we have a split flow here in the um, over the western U.S. Still a westerly flow in the east. We still have our trough here over the southeast and above normal heights across this region, over um, Canada and Alaska, and then uh, back up a little bit. We can still have our trough here near the Aleutians. going to go to the end of the period and this is we'll go to near the end this is the 25th and we see a westerly flow across much of the east central u.s still a split flow here in the western u.s now this model here which is the um canadian has above normal temperatures uh, above normal heights across much of the nation now the anomalies during this forecast period are depicting different solutions we can see here, this is one of the anomalies below normal temperatures in, in the southern Rockies and to the plains, which I think this would be the more likely scenario. And then we see this one uh, below normal temperatures in the plains, above normal temperatures across the northern Rockies and so forth. So during this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures here. I'm using a combination of the ensembles. 
above normal temperatures here, below normal temperatures for this area, and the anomalies for this forecast period. will be uh, about 15 degrees above normal in parts of the northern Rockies, below normal temperatures for Southern California, the four corners with anomalies of 15 to 20 degrees are forecast. So this is how it looks on the map. Then we go for precipitation, so forecasting above normal precipitation for this area. So that is the long range weather forecast discussion for May 14th to 26th. Thank you for coming to Jim Monley's World of Weather and have a good day.